Ahoy, folks! Tris here with a quick news update on Sonic the Hedgehog 3, the third Sonic movie. Back on Friday, there was a ton of news dropped for the film, including the new logo, the announcement of Jim Carrey's return as Robotnik, and more. But one of the other big details was the teaser's inclusion of some recognizable notes from Live and Learn, the main theme to Sonic Adventure 2. And for those that doubted it was there, the lead singer of Crush 40 himself, Johnny Joelli, tweeted about it, saying, hmm, that song sounds familiar, doesn't it? With a winking emoji. So yeah, Live and Learn was indeed used in the teaser. But the big question is if it'll be in the full movie. After all, the teaser for Sonic the Hedgehog 2 used the Emerald Hill theme. But this song never actually appeared in the full movie. And thanks to Mason Parkinson, it's since been learned that some fans took to asking Johnny directly. And he replied to several fans, seemingly indicating that, yes, Live and Learn will be used in the movie. But to what degree or where, he can only guess. In Sonic Adventure 2, the song was used during the climax to the game. So Johnny's guess of near the end makes perfect sense. But for all we know, it could also just be used for the credits theme. It's hard to say for sure, really. But Johnny does suggest we'll be hearing Live and Learn sometime during the film's runtime. Personally, even before this teaser, I had hoped we'd have one of the movie's battles between Sonic and Shadow take place near a music festival, where Crush 40 would be performing the song. You know, just something tongue-in-cheek and silly. So here's hoping Live and Learn wasn't just for the teaser, and we'll hear it in the movie. But what do you guys think? Where do you think we'll hear Live and Learn in Sonic the Hedgehog 3? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and stay tuned to Game is Playing for plenty more on Sonic Movie 3 and other things gaming as well, of course. Until next time, farewell.